All right, so what I would like to show you is um, the issue I encountered with the transparent PNGs and the solution that I'm proposing um, that we do. So one thing I noticed right away, once I get the PNGs to work, is that when you switch from one to another, the edges around the bottle look really bad. And that's really just caused by the way the browser transitions. Um, there's nothing that we can do about that. Um, except for uh, not using transparencies and instead using a gradient background. So the first thing you want to do is go to Photoshop and open up this gradient that I've sent you um, and you would do that. I'll just uh, show you how to do it again. File, open, bottle gradient and you want to go to image mode RGB color and image size you'll notice is 273 by 700 so you know that this is going to fit exactly in the spot that we've designated for the bottle on the website then you want to open your transparent uh, PNGs that you've already got created so Vernacia, there it is and what you can do is select all, edit copy, edit paste and it should be centered perfectly. So now you can just file, save for web and I like to save as GIFs for the web because they're actually the smallest files. Um, I mean you can use something else if you want to but this is what I would do. And just click save Vernicia save and you're done. Just upload that Vernicia, the new one that we just created with the gradient to the website and it should look fine. Um, so I would do that with uh, with all of your bottles. It doesn't take too long and um, and you know especially when you have the size here you don't have to worry about resizing anything if you're just copying and pasting into it it, it works fine. Alrighty, good luck.